What's crack is Mac Lacknell, you'll go five with you connect with another or our first Madden NFL twenty one video. I wish that only be the show. Would have been a bad start. Uh, here to talk about how to download the most updated rosters, including the brand new rookies who were just drafted this past weekend on PS4. Note this is Madden, so there's no cross play, there's no cross saving of stuff, which sucks, but it's how it works. Get over it. The way you do it, you go down here. You go to share and manage files. Download community files. I have them downloaded. I'm going to download them again to show you. Make sure you guys actually know what you're doing because, quite frankly, I don't really know what I'm doing. And I hit sort. Come on, search. You're going to search for online ID. And on PS4, you're going to look for NFL, all caps. The word the with a capital T. And the word zone with a capital Z. No spaces, none of that nonsense, and bam, you got this one roster here. I already have it downloaded. I'm going to overwrite because why not? And then, how first things first, go to load and delete files. You go to rosters. The roster's titled Madden 22, even though it'll probably be a little off. The guy's just trying to make himself look different than all the people who are just saying NFL draft. You do that, and now that it's loaded, the way you'd be able to view this without joining a franchise would be, if you were to start a franchise, if I were to start a franchise right now, I'd have those rosters. I'm not going to do that yet. I'm just going to show you how to view them outside of a franchise, manage rosters, order depth chart. Uh, let me get a, I'm a Steelers fan, so I know who the Steelers drafted and know the team pretty well. Running back, first round pick, Najee Harris. Look at that guy actually having his picture in the game and all. I guess it's because he's in month. But you see the rest of their depth chart, including the off-season signings, Kalen Balaj. I'm surprised that he's a 70. The Steelers' next pick was tight end Fryermuth, 72 overall. Yes, center Kendrick Green, and they took a tackle. I don't know if he was left or right. I don't even know where he'd be on the roster. There he is. Nope, that's Kevin Dotson, our guard. You all get the idea though, you go through and you find the guy on each team you're looking for. Say I went, let's head to the Jaguars and show off their brand new shiny quarterback. Not their tackles, no one cares about them. I mean, some people do, but not me. Bam, Trevor Lawrence. 77 overall, that's probably the highest one here for all the rookie, all the new rookies. You see, the guys who are actually rookies are still rookies because you can't really change that without editing every player in the game. and. No sane human being would do that. But you got Trevor Lawrence here, 86. That's actually a pretty good looking quarterback. Speed wise, at least. Throw power, 92. Short, medium, and deep. That's passable. In a year or two, that card will, or that player will be insane. Then uh, I guess I'll start up a franchise to show you what it'll look like in there. On PS4, so that's the loading screen, so those of you watching on PS5. If you're on another console, it'll be the same idea. We just don't have an exact draft to use. So I gotta create a new league. Use active roster. I think that's the one I'm supposed to do. Select the team you want to join. Start your season with Yeah, well, and it's Mike Tomlin. For the, for the case of this, I don't Start care. your I week by installing your game plan. Now you see they're very negative about the Steelers right now. And bam, you got the team in. You see up there at center, Kendrick Green. Running back, you got Harris. You got Frymouth out there. This is the player don't know card. Why I clicked Here on him, but Eric Smith strength. is here. Look at this. Dan Moore. Steelers line is awful right now. But yet, to the defense, you can see anyone else they picked up. I mean, team ain't looking great, but it's the right team. Louder Milk, their rookie linebacker who they traded up to get for some reason. 
Johnson, I believe, is also. Yeah, Buddy Johnson, that's our fifth round pick right there. Our second, fourth, I should say. He's a fourth or a fifth. Roche was a fifth. You're seeing, right now it's only the first five rounds. Personally, I'd wait until you can find, in a day or two, this guy will have at least the seven rounds, maybe even free, undrafted free agents. I'd wait till then. I'd show any team you want. Uh, I'll choose, here's a team I actually know the first round pick of. Um, the Texans didn't have one. There's Bing. Bengals took that receiver. Jamar Chase. Wow, that's a good looking receiver. Sorry, all, all I saw was 93 speed on a rookie. 21 years old rookie with 93 speed. 85 cat. That's gonna get by. Wow, they this can. You see the idea? I accidentally had out too. Shifted to the Bills. But you all get the idea. Jamar Chase. I think Jaguars with their first pick. I showed you the Trevor Lawrence already. Or, but then if I that's fullback, running back. Travis Etienne. Why wow, they have Carlos Hyde? Good for him. Now, but Travis Etienne. The contract should be in place. I don't believe there'll be a fifth-year option due to the nature of how creating a Madden roster works. You can't add player options naturally. But beyond that, it should, it's probably going to be very close to what they actually get. And the other contracts should all be either correct, exactly correct or very close. As close as Madden normally is anyway. But you see, all the players for the first high round should be in there. Uh, that's about all I have to go over here today. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this, make sure you like and subscribe. Madden content will be coming when the new Madden comes out or maybe when we get information on I'm not sure yet. But until then, it's probably going to be mostly MLB The Show. If you enjoy that game and haven't watched yet, please do. Any support on the channel means a lot. Comments, likes, subscribes. Fight the YouTube algorithm. Something I've heard a lot lately. Uh, thank you for watching, and as always, the best is yet to come.